It was calling me a boy And as I climbed inside I saw you sitting there I have to freeze this because I was about to burn my apartment down. I don't know what happened or why the tomato went on fire, but okay, let's try this again without burning my apartment down. All right, <laughs> let's. Give this another shot. Uh, how scary was that? I don't know what happened. I don't know if the oil went in the gas, but thank God it was nothing serious. I'm glad my lashes are still in place. It didn't burn down or my brows. <laughs> uh, but I'm making myself a quick little iced coffee and I finally nailed it because I was struggling trying to make iced coffee from home. So as per TikTok, I take a teaspoon of instant coffee with a equal amount of or a little less sugar I put that in my mason jar cup glass whatever you desire um, also can we talk about these really cute canisters I love love it I and mean, my kitchen is super organized and I'm obsessed with it <laughs> but then I take very little hot water for my really cool rose gold kettle I got from Target uh, so I put equal amount of water just a little bit not too much and then I take my favorite frother. You don't have to use this frother. Um, you can use a fork and just whisk it as you go or a whisker, but I use this because it saves me time. So I whisk away until it's nice and a little bit of creamy and fluffy, but this really tastes like a delicious iced coffee from a luxurious cafe, except it's from home. So with that, I add some ice, I add some oat milk or almond milk with a little bit of creamer. And honestly, it's the best iced coffee or latte I've ever had. So back to breakfast before I burn <laughs> really it this time. Um, I'm just gonna add some eggs, but I do like that my vegetables was a little sauteed. Uh, and for si and daddy, ira karoi megan, tohme watani kadim, but I added some eggs. Um, I'm just gonna stir that up, add a little salt and pepper. I do like my eggs to be sort of a little bit of sunny side up. Um, and I usually don't have this breakfast every day at all. Today I was not feeling the greatest. So <laughs> I needed a little something in the morning um, and I hadn't had it in a long time. So I figured I'll treat myself. I really look like a homeless person. <laughs> Let me turn this around. Will this do any good? No. But anyways, I'm gonna just quickly get ready. Try to transform my face a little bit. I'm not doing anything extravagant, but a little bit of um, just so I don't look like I'm a homeless person. My sister said something so good. She said, Zara, you have a dreamy car, you have a dreamy apartment, you have a dreamy job. You have the dream life, but you don't look like a dream. She's like, if I were, if I didn't know you, I would look at you and say, well, this girl is sad. This girl, I mean, I do look sad. I am sad. <laughs> I do look homeless. Um, I'm not trying to say like I need to look glamorous all the time, but I should be presentable because when you look good, you feel good. And when you feel good, you do good if that makes sense. So I'm going to put a little bit more of an effort to not just have my apartment spanking clean because let me tell you, my apartment, it is 
spanking clean like i just cleaned it every nook and corner it feels so good to come to an apartment that is spotless like let me show you how organized i am like look at the level of this organization like these are my cabinets like everything's like lined up like my face masks are lined up so up oh, here we go this is crooked but my apartment itself is super super organized it's just i need to look the part so i've made a promise that going forward whether no matter how i feel i'm gonna put an effort to look good so let me put the camera down we're gonna speed up this this little tutorial this little makeup and just look presentable <laughs> managed to do but i have to say you guys a little bit of makeup a little bit of an effort goes a long way i have to tell this myself like when i'm not in the mood to put makeup on not necessarily because i don't feel good um i just am like not in the mood period to put makeup on that it really makes a difference obviously i look like a brand new person or like a whole different person rather but my point is i feel better i feel good all of a sudden i have energy i'm like ready to conquer and this is just really minimal like i just threw some hoops and a necklace just to kind of look presentable semi for like the video um but it goes a long way i need to do i need to do this more often this cute pink metallic comp set i got from forever 21 actually looking at this clip now all of my brushes are from forever 21 i love the metallic ombre look super fun adds a lot of color um i'm filming this in the bathroom because i have the maintenance guy over who's going to install my tv and mount on the wall so definitely updated apartment coming for sure but i'm just tweaking the bathroom here and there putting this back in the cabinet but i think we should do a quick little forever 21 haul what do you say all right so the first thing that i got from forever at 21 um i got a lot of athletic wear i love love forever 21's athletic wear they're number one super affordable i love the material they're almost like spanx where it kind of just sucks everything in and i love a nice little like tummy tummy tuck through leggings um so i got this this is from forever 21 and it was $12.99, I mean, a steal. These are shorts, high-rise shorts, um, size large. I, the only reason I got a large because they run super, super small. I got a large because they run small. Um, I got the shorts, and I don't think I got the sports bra. Actually, I did get a sports bra, but I already wore it, so I don't have it here in the rack. But really great material, but really nice and stretchy. I really love the fact that it has like a high rise, high waisted, I'm all about that. So I got that and I like that these are not like booty shorts. I am not about the booty shorts life. Like, mm -mm. <laughs> just, I'm not about that life. Um, maybe like in the comfort of my home. I don't mind that, but in public, nobody's going to see my booty in public. Um, anyways, love this. The next thing I got as I am going to put these away. I'll throw that in there for now. I got this really cute matching said it's legging and a sports bra i think i paid separately for these or together no together 
And you guys, Forever 21 had a sale and they were indeed together. I think this set, believe it or not, sounds outrageous, but I might have only paid $5 or 6 or 8 Like, it was a ridiculous price. This is the matching. This is the sports bra. Super cute. There's no support, really. There's no support at all. Um, but I'm okay with it because... I think this is something I would wear to like yoga or when I'm doing abs, but not really cardio because I need support when I do cardio. But this is the legging and then this is the, not the legging, this is the sports bra and this is the legging. And again, I'm pretty sure I got this under $10. Super duper cute. I don't know if you can see the print. Let me come up closer. It's almost like Easter colors. You got your pastel purple, little yellow. Um, I don't even mind wearing this around the apartment just to like lounge in. Love that. I'm gonna. I'm so excited to like finally clean this rag because this rag has been just piling up and collecting of things that I bought and need to fill, and it's just like it's much needed for me to finally clear out this rack. All right, so. I'm gonna throw everything into my bed because after I film this haul, I'm gonna put everything in my drawer, which I'm, I cannot wait to show you my drawer also because I like literally revamped my drawer, but I wanna save that for a different video. Uh, okay, next thing I got was this cute little tank top. This was on sale as well. You guys, $5. Don't mind my nails. <laughs> Um, I'm gonna have no nail polish on for the remaining of the month of September only because I'm letting my nails breathe that includes my toes I am NOT doing any pedicure manicure. I'm gonna do pedicure as far as like cleaning it, but no polish Because um, it needs to breathe Any whoosies. Why am I always off topic? Um, so I got this cute little tank top again for working out only five dollars super cute polka dot um, and affordable next up I kind of regret this looking at it now because I'm like, what, what is this? <laughs> uh, but it was 12 bucks and I felt like maybe I could make it into a shirt with jeans because I would never wear this as a dress. It's just a little too tacky for me. Uh, but um, it's all about the, the shoulders. I've seen really big shoulders at Met Gala, New York Fashion Week. That's all I saw, these big couture shoulders. So I thought for like a casual look, I might just like cut this or tie it in a knot somehow and make this into like a t-shirt versus a dress to wear it with the jeans um, but it was only 12 bucks so no regret there i'm taking them out of the hangers because i'm gonna put them in my closet and this for sure will be folded like this little t-shirt dress just not to be hung um 12 dollars super great price so that's that um oh my god you guys this I, I'm just so excited about it. I have to steam it for you, for you to really see the beauty of it. I'm going to steam this and try it on and then insert the clip here separately because it is such a luxurious skirt. Like when I saw this on the model, I'm like, is this Forever 21? Am I still on Forever 21? Like it looks so luxurious. It looks so sexy. Obviously the material is not the greatest because again, it is Forever 21, meaning it's not going to be real silk and, and if it's real silk, you're going to pay for the price of real silk. This was on sale for, let me see, uh, I don't even know. Pistachio is the color, but the price, this was I think around $12 and it's really this beautiful like um, maxi skirt, accentuates your booty very well, your waist. I cannot wait to actually wear this outside, but I'm gonna steam it and try it on for you guys so you can see how sexy and luxurious this is. I went and it's got a size large because Forever 21 runs really, really small. Their large is like, <laughs> all right. <laughs> um, that was the front desk guy. I have the maintenance guy coming up and hanging up my TV. I'm so excited because this apartment is slowly but surely coming together. Um, I've also lived here for nine months, so I think it's about time this apartment comes together. Um, it's been together. For those of you who do know me, my, my friends and family, they're like, I don't know how you've done this, but this studio looks really, really, really gorgeous. And I, I mean, I'm proud of it. But anyways, back to the haul, and then I'll talk more about the apartment. So really nice, silky, silky, long maxi skirt, $12, Forever 21. There's just 
the best retail therapy because when I'm feeling down, I don't want to go spend ham on my money, but I, I need a little like, you know, like a uplift, a little like mood booster and Forever 21 is that because I get to get new clothes and try it on and have fun with it, but also I'm not emptying my wallet. It's like really like, I think I got everything for less than a hundred bucks. Like it's a steal. So I got the pistachio color, really nice. We'll try it on for you. The next thing that I got is another skirt. Um, it's more of like a champagne color. Um, I mean, the material is really cheap. I'm so sorry not to disrespect Forever 21, but it is the purpose of it. You get really affordable, cheap prices, but don't expect to have this like luxurious fabric. Um, so I'm okay with it. These are things that I'm gonna wear once or twice and donate the rest. Um, so this was also under like $12 and it's a really nice skirt that I thought was super sexy. Again, I'm gonna steam this and try it on and I think with a nice like silky black tank top, it will be really nice for a girls night out. So I'm excited. Again, I will certainly steam this and try it on for you guys separately. I'm just currently very bloated. <laughs> so I don't wanna try it on this second because I am bloated. So maybe like tomorrow or Saturday. Today's Thursday, by the way. All right, we're almost there. Again, really affordable um, athletic wear. This is a cropped little sweater that I can wear um, during my run because it's we're headed to fall, obviously. So it's a little breezy out. I can't just run with a sports bra. I like to throw a little something on. So it's not that cold where I need a full on long sleeve hoodie, but a little crop top like this. And again, this was $5 steel. I'm gonna put that away as well. This was, this honestly was like two bucks. This cute little polka dot crop top was two bucks. I got this for around the apartment as loungewear. Again, these are things that I'm not gonna go like dress up in, but around loungewear for two bucks, it was a steal. I think it was two to three dollars. I mean, I, I fell in love with it. Um, we're almost there. I know I got a bunch of more accessories that I'm gonna find for you. Um, I got another pair of leggings. Really comfortable. This was on sale for $8. Again, I love stretchy materials. This is great also for when I do yoga or abs or anything that is not cardio related because when I do cardio, I like to have like a thicker material, almost like Spanx, like a Lululemon or even the booty shorts that I showed you. Uh, I just like things that are more, um, more firm. This is a bit more on the softer side, so I don't mind this for when I do yoga or when I do at work. So I love this, super comfortable. I can even wear there. I can even wear this for loungewear. So I got that eight dollars. Thank you, Forever Twenty One, for being super duper affordable. Uh, what else? Oh, I got another color of that same exact little cropped sleeve, short sleeve hoodie uh, for when I do runs or loungewear. I mean, you can wear this really anywhere. That's that, and I got a pajama set. This was on sale for $12, super cute. I just wished I went a size bigger. I don't know why I got this in a size small. Like I said, I'm not a small in Forever 21 because their stuff does run super, super small. So I went ahead and I took a uh, large and everything else, but for some reason this pajama set, I got a small and they're like a little tight. I mean, it's not like I can't wear them, they're just a little tight. But I love this pajama set, it's super cute. And again, this is for me to lounge in, wear around the apartment, just to make myself feel good and look cute because if you look good, you feel good, you do good. So this is just for myself. Um, that is it as far as the clothing part. Oh no, I like, I did get jeans that I will show because I was already wearing them. So I'm gonna pull up the jeans. Really love the jeans. I also got jeans and a lot of accessories. So let me just grab that. The reason that's not here because A, I already wore their jeans and I fell in love with them. Um, it's funny because when the jeans first arrived, I tried them on and I was so like disappointed because they were tight. And I said, not even tight, they wouldn't even close. And I said, I am not returning them. Zara, this is not the direction we wanna to go to. The direction you were heading is you gaining weight and that's not who I am. Like. I mean, it's normal to fluctuate weight and, and gain weight and lose weight and gain weight because that's just our bodies. It is okay. 
but I was constantly gaining weight and I'm like not doing that. Like I am disciplined enough to know that this is not the direction we want to go in. So I, I lost so much weight. I mean, I lost six pounds in less than three weeks. So for me, that's a lot to some people, maybe not, but now the jeans fit beautifully. So let me go grab the jeans and accessories that I got. I'll be right back. All right. So I'm going to sit for the remaining of this quick little haul. Uh, it'll be sweet and short. I got three different headbands. These headbands, you guys, were only $3 each. So I was like, I have to have these. It's a really cute, velvety, um, gold-ish, gold pear almost, like a mustard color with pearls, $3. I thought it was super cute. And then I got the black as well that I already actually wore once. So I don't have the ticket, but it was $3 as well. Um, and then I got this cute pink one. It almost has like that little uh, turban knot effect, which I really like. I don't think I'm gonna actually wear them um, because now we're headed towards fall in pink. I mean, for me at least, this is more like a summer headband. Maybe I'll throw it in, but I think I'm gonna save this for this summer of next year. And I have a whole drawer, a whole drawer of headbands that I finally organized. Um, so I'll definitely show you that. And then the jeans I was talking about earlier is this. I honestly was so surprised how comfortable these Forever 21 jeans were. Um, I got a size 27, I think. Yes, that's my size, 27 in Forever 21 jeans. But here's a little fun story or like embarrassing story. This wasn't actually this cut of a low. It was like that. Um, I remember going grocery shopping and then my jeans got stuck in the card. And when I like went the other direction, I hear like this rip and all of a sudden my jeans ripped and I was so taken like off guard and I was so glad that my jeans ripped, not my actual skin. Um, so it's not like the worst thing in the world. I can still like wear it. Is it what I like wanted? No, but I'd rather like not cut my leg off. Um, so this is the look, but this is not how they, they are how they came. This was me just being stuck to the shopping cart. And then I think that is it. Oh no, I got shoes also. Let me just quickly show you the shoes that I got. I don't know if I put them here. Yes. So the shoes that I got, this is my shoe closet. I think I already put this away, but I got these shoes as well from Forever 21. These were like $20, I think. Um, not so bad. Um, I'm not gonna lie, it, it, hold on, let me get down to the camera. Um, but I'm not gonna lie, it kind of looks a little cheap. I mean, it is cheap. It doesn't look cheap. It is cheap. It's $20, so I didn't expect it to look like really fancy, but it didn't even look like what it was online. It kind of looked online like a soft pink, so I'm not too crazy about these, um, but I'm not gonna like throw them out. Like I, I'm sure I can wear this in the summer with like some ripped jeans and a tank, uh, but this is not a shoe that I'm gonna wear for the remaining of the year. For the fall, it's definitely a summer heel. But I think for 20 bucks and in the moment, I'm okay with it. Uh, but this is my last item from my Forever 21 haul. All right, you guys, I don't know how time flew by so fast, but um, the day went just by really fast. I did get caught up into editing, as you can see. I was into a deep editing hole. Um, and I of course did the voiceover. Now looking back at this clip, I'm like, what are you doing? I'm doing a voiceover as we speak, <laughs> actually. Guys, I don't know how quickly time flew today. I was supposed to sort of vlog all day long, but it's like 9.30 at night and my hair looks like a mess. Um, so don't mind me. I am gonna obviously wipe my face off um, wash my face, take these lashes off. I just like, oh, you guys, this is the best feeling. Two things I love to do at the end of every day is take my lashes off. That is if I'm wearing false lashes and to take my bra off. It's like this power of freedom. <laughs> uh, but anyways, it is currently 9.30 PM. I do have a really early day of work tomorrow. Um, I just got caught up with filming and editing, and then I went to Trader Joe's. Um, so I'm gonna do a quick little Trader Joe haul for you. Also, let me show you the maintenance guy came and installed 
are mounted the TV on the wall. Let me flip the camera. Let me just, ta-da, it's finally up. Let me flip the camera so you can probably see it. And there it is. It looks so good. I just have to finish this um, drawer. Um, I have a whole video that I'm currently in the process of finishing editing of how I literally made this dresser. I made this dresser, you guys. Um, I just have to finish covering this top portion with wallpaper. This is all wallpaper, but I'm going to save that for the, for the video. I basically am filming a video of how to transform Ikea furniture into more of an elevated look. Um, you can see in the corner, the the wallpaper is coming off, but I, I have to redo that bottom shelf. Anyways, off topic, the TV is mounted. It looks so good. I do have to get a little something to cover the wire. For those of you who know me, it is going to bug me. It's going to bother me. Um, also, don't mind my nails. Like I said, I'm giving it a break for the remaining of September. And then I'm going to go and obviously go back to my mani petty and all that good stuff. But I really love how this apartment is coming along. <laughs> um, I also do have my shoes here lined up i have my sneakers tory sneakers that i'm filming bright in, in the morning it's a product review i'm currently working with them they've sent me all four sneakers in different colors i have the fourth one on the side um but i am currently filming for them a product review i've already did the photo shoots i've already did the reels so that is already up on my instagram if you don't follow me on Insta, make sure you follow me on Insta because I am always up to date on there. I'm much more hands-on on Instagram. I'm more involved than I'm on YouTube, um, but I am certainly catching up on YouTube as well. But all these goodies are up already on the gram. I'm gonna just quickly clean the kitchen a little bit. Um, even though I do have a little office station in the corner, I just don't know why I always tend to work in the kitchen. Uh, but I'm going to do a quick little Trader Joe haul, put that away, and then call it. All right, it's it's definitely, certainly a little messy here. Um, but I already have my fridge clean and organized because it's always cleaned and organized. Um, I have, what did I get? I got Trader Joe's Pecan Instant Oatmeal. I'm excited to try that. Um, I got oil because I needed to refill this little oil situation. I need to change the label. But I got dressing, cilantro dressing that I love. I got peanut butter that I love to have as a snack with my um, green apples. What else did I get? Cheese. I love to make a really good charcuterie board. Charcuterie board or cheese board, whatever. Uh, you want to call it strawberries for my oatmeal or just because uh, these are not good for you, but I had to get these. I love them. They were only $2.60, $2 which is a steal because in Starbucks, they sell like only three units for like four bucks. But anyways, I got bread to make sandwiches. I got jelly for if I'm in the mood for peanut butter and jelly. A whole case of water. I'm going to plop that in the fridge. I got hummus. I got this really cool butternut squash mac and cheese bites. Um, it looks really good. I don't know how good it is, but we're going to give it a, a try. Hummus. I got chicken breast or ch roasted chicken. Oh, this is chicken breast. Gross. I thought it was turkey breast. Um, dang it, but it's fine. Um, to make sandwiches, I got a pre-made wrap, spicy lentil wrap. I love taking this to work. Days when I don't have time to like prep. Usually I do prep. If you look at my fridge, let me show you my fridge, you guys. It's a pretty like semi-organized, like you'll see, I have mason jars already packed to throw either milk or yogurt in it or make oatmeal out of it. I do have some Afghani prepped meal, I have dessert and leftover pizza. <laughs> uh, but my point is I do meal prep. I do have some prepped meals in here. I do have to throw this box out, but pretty organized if you ask me. I even have like my Bread's organized. Tomatoes are, they're sad. They're sad looking. Uh, but anyways, uh, what else did I get? I got quinoa. Don't mind my lashes. That's gross. I got quinoa. I got lettuce. Oh, this is so good. I can't wait to try this. Arugula. I just got this because I wanted to try it before I got more, but it looks good. Creamy almond yogurt. Uh, cultured. It's actually, cultured is good for you. You ladies, 
I'm not going to say why on YouTube, but it's really good for you. Uh, I got chicken breast. I know it's not halal. Forgive me. Uh, what else? I got this broccoli and kale salad that I like to use. Cucumber, bananas. And, oh, I got this juicer. Juicer from Target. A little candle from Marshalls that I want to decorate the top of the... guys <laughs> um this video is turning longer than i expected so i am sorry for that uh, but i'm gonna end this video here i changed it in my pajamas uh i still have to wash my face so i'm gonna do that and just just sleep because i have a really early day of work tomorrow i have to be at work at eight in the morning so that means i have to leave at seven probably be up at 5 36 to just look presentable remember what i said at the beginning of the video to put an effort uh plus i'm going out to dinner tomorrow but no more talking because i talk a lot this video is 35 minutes long nobody wants to watch you for 35 minutes long all right <laughs> and if i come here to say quickly i'll be i'll be quick um uh, but i just wanted to say thank you so so much for your kind sweet messages for my previous video if you if you don't know what i'm talking about please watch my previous video um, and for those of you who have watched it, the whole 60 minutes, um, I got an overwhelming amount of love and support. Thank you so much for taking the time out of your day to message me, to tell me that you can relate, to tell me that you can connect, to appreciate my honesty and allowing me to open up and allowing me to be myself. It was very vulnerable and a little bit scary to just put yourself out there, especially here on the internet. So I thank you so much for always, always supporting me. Um, but I am going to call it a night because this video cannot be an hour long. <laughs> Have a good night, guys.